Hi guys, this is Christian from swimfly.com. Today we're going to learn how to swim butterfly in three steps and only one lesson. Uh, so to learn how to swim butterfly is pretty simple. Uh, you just need to respect the basics, okay, and his skills on the right, right movement. And the butterfly is one of the strokes the most simple to, to swim actually. A lot of people, they are like, wow, butterfly is so so hard, so complicated, so tiring, so stressful, you are so good, you know, to swim butterfly. But actually, it's not true. The butterfly is something, it's really natural. You need to feel correctly the movement in the water. You need to feel the waves, because it's part of movement, like a dolphin, but it's very simple. So the step number one to swim butterfly is to learn how to execute the dolphin kick. A, a butterfly uh, strokes, is not like a freestyle stroke where the legs are kicking one after one like this. The both feet are together, the knees are together, and you kick like a dolphin tail, okay, like a whale, like a mermaid, okay. So very simple to learn how to do this trick. You can just practice sitting here, now we here, and basically you can sit, understand the movement, and. Is like this. My legs go down and I kick up. The kicking needs to be up to the sky here. And I kick. You see? My feet flat, my knees flat. I kick up. I kick up. I kick up. Okay, that's the kick. The freestyle is like this. When the butterfly is like this. Okay, you bend a little bit your legs and your knees. So, because you are on the other side, right? It's on the back. You will be like this. And kick. Boom. 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 Can you listen that sound behind me? Boom. 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 That's the sound of the tail, right? So listen that sound because it's very important for, for learning after that. And one kick. Boom. Two kick. Boom. Three kick. Boom. Four kick. Boom. Every time I kick, there is a boom. There is a boom because my legs are on the surface. Okay? So don't forget to kick, kick, kick on the surface. So now, you need to practice inside the water. Let's go. So I know, I know how to execute my boom, 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 which is my kicking on butterfly, right? So I'm gonna learn how to do it into the arrow butterfly, which is the step number one, is the arrow butterfly. So my hands far away, my head under. I blow my bubbles. I don't see my head here, it's kicking flatly. And I do boom, 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 boom with my legs, blowing bubbles for something like five meters or more, okay? And nothing much. Okay, you are learning. It's very basic, so take it easy. We practice again. Try to feel the pum pum and you are moving forward. Okay? Arrow position like this with the pum. -pum. Okay? So very simple. This is the arrow butterfly. Okay, a last little tips. When you do your pum pum, right, it's butterfly. Remember to try to kick not only, not only from your knees or from your feet. The butterfly kick starts from the lower body, but the upper portion of the lower body. So it starts from your stomach, from your abs, from your hips. Okay, the kick is actually starting from here. I move my butt behind, I kick, boom, I go, I go forward with my hips. Behind, forward, behind, forward. So it's not something where you are just kicking like this with your knees, you know, and I'm here. It's not like kick, kick, kick. It's more like I kick with all my lower body, okay? And I'm not only kicking with my knees and my legs, okay? If you can feel it, then it's like this. Then your kicking will be more effective, okay? So now I know how to do my arrow butterfly. So let's learn the step number two. You need to learn how to move your both hands together like freestyle. 
This is freestyle only one hand, going back. The butterfly is both hand together, pulling to the end, then flying back on the side to reach the front again, together. Double pulling until the end, and then fly back on the side to go back together. When you fly back on the side, don't bend your elbow. Try to fly with a big circle on the side, your fingers relax above the surface of the water. Try to touch the water as far as possible on the front. So pull and fly back, go back in the water. So we're gonna learn how to do the pulling, the double pulling, executing the pum pum. The pum pum are the dolphin kicks. But you cannot breathe. The breathing is the last step. So we're gonna learn how to do this movement. One dolphin, two dolphin, you move your hands together. And again, one dolphin, two dolphin, you move your hands together. One dolphin, two dolphin, you move your hands together. At the first dolphin, stretch your arms forward. At the second dolphin, you can double pull and go back on the front. Go slowly and go easy. Remember, you are learning. It's all about sensation. So, let's try. You cannot breathe, so I want you to keep your head underwater looking at the bottom of the water. Okay, so at some point you will need to take a breath, which is normal, so you stop at that moment. I repeat again. Don't focus on looking up. Simple. One dolphin, two dolphin, move your hands, okay? Go slowly and go easy. Okay, the very basic strokes for beginners. Now you have the motion. This is step number two. You know how to do your double pulling and going back on the side. So the real butterfly is actually be able to do the same, but you can breathe. You can take a breath every two double pulling. So you're gonna learn now how to do the same things, but at the second time you're gonna move your hands, you can breathe up near to the water with your mouth and dive again with your head under the water to go back into the arrow position and continue the dolphin. So one dolphin, two dolphin, move your hands but don't breathe. One dolphin, two dolphin, move your hand but you breathe up one time and go down and again. One dolphin, two dolphin, stay down. One dolphin, two dolphin, goes up and go down. Okay? So that's the last step. Step number three. Breathe every two strokes. Let's go. Okay, take it easy. When you can do that, you will have a better notion of what is the butterfly after you're gonna practice more on your waves you're gonna practice more on your relaxed movement on the strength of your hand for the pulling but that's the motion one big dolphin move your hands two big dolphin move your hands and every time you move your hands you have another little dolphin behind that's why it's two dolphin one dolphin move your hands with another dolphin one dolphin Move your hand with another dolphin. Butterfly is all about being smooth in the water. Okay, relax your lower body, feel it right, feel you can fly, and then the butterfly will become very, very simple. Okay, so this is Christian from swimfly.com. You can download our method to learn how to swim with us directly on the website. I hope this video helps you a lot. Thank you.